Hey everybody, so uh, I've been, as some of like my, you know, really close friends know, I've been having a really hard time lately with anxiety and feelings of depression. Um, because, you know, for, well, well, basically what's been happening is that a lot of my security is like being taken away and so that's for me I've always had a problem with change like I don't do well with change at all and so it's and it's like it's coming from everywhere all kind of things you know um just the uncertainty that's surrounding us right now is very overwhelming and so I haven't been really doing that well you know I've been trying you know really trying and um but last night I was, I was, you know, talking to Keith, just kind of unloading everything, and he, you know, started talking to me about, you know, the stories in the Bible and how they relate to me, to us, and it was just amazing. Like, God gave me this incredible clarity that I just, it was, that was overwhelming, the because I just was, you know, I was laying on the couch talking to him and that weight that was on me of depression, of fear, of, I mean, all these horrible feelings, I felt, I just felt them lift off of me and all I could see was Jesus, was the goodness of God and his faithfulness and it's like I've been praying for days for wisdom and for clarity and I could see things so clearly last night. It was incredible. And so it's just like I felt a million times better. Like it was it was awesome. And so uh so I just feel like God you know just <laughs> just so sure that God is with me, that God hears me, that God knows what I need, that God my hair is crazy, <laughs> that God, uh, he answered me, he answered my prayer, and he said that, you know, if we seek him, we will find him, that's a promise, and so, that's what I'm doing, like, this morning, I'm spending more time, you know, seeking him, I am, uh, I, I just see so clearly what I need to do to, to find that peace that I need, that peace that, and that security that I feel has been taken away. But honestly, the only real security that we have is Jesus, and it ain't going anywhere. That's, that's something that will never be taken from us, and, and I just, I feel that sense of peace from that truth, and it is just incredible. Um, one that he read me, one verse, or chapter, that he read me was in second peter and it just hit me so hard like it was incredible because it was just exactly what i needed and it's like and i pray that you know i mean it's such a good verse and it can like i mean it applies to everybody so i would suggest reading it it's really good but it was just incredible and I don't even know if I'm going to post this. I feel like it's just for me really just to remember, you know, how good God is and and how he just came in and answered answered my 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 prayers, and heard my brokenness and my cries and and he is just so faithful. He's so faithful and and I pray I pray that y'all would get that and understand that and experience the truth in that because truly the scariest darkest times in my life the the biggest trials that I have faced the way they say like our our suffering is for our good it glorifies God it 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 all that stuff is hard to believe but but it it, it is it is true that's truth and it's just incredible the way God will use our pain and our suffering for our good, for our growth, and to, to show and remind us how good He is. Like, it's it's incredible. And um, I'm just really, really grateful for, for that relationship with Jesus because if I didn't have that, I don't know where I'd be. I, I fear that I wouldn't even be here because of how strongly Satan 
you know, attacks me, fights against me, uses my weaknesses, and it's like, but I have Jesus, and I cling to Jesus with everything that I have. The, the tiny, like he says, the tiniest bit of strength, you know, that little mustard seed of faith, you know, if that's all I have, it's enough, and it has gotten me through those scary moments of depression. People who deal with depression, you know how scary it can be. It is terrifying at times, but I have made it through every single time, and it is only because of Jesus. All glory, all praise is to Jesus because he is the one that gets me through it every single time. And uh, even today, I feel this this lightness about about things. I feel this peace, this comfort, this security, this uh, like I can I can just breathe now. You know what I mean? Because like my true security is not it's not going anywhere. It's not nobody can take it from me. Nobody can. You know what I mean? It's unshakable. It's it's just an amazing feeling when when you're able to like to fully put your trust in God. And that peace is something that nothing else in this world can give you. Nobody else in this world can give you and it's amazing. God is so good. God is so good. <laughs>